What's up guys? In today's two minute Photoshop tutorial, we're gonna go over um, how to add textures and various effects to text. Uh, primarily textures, but also we'll, we'll dabble in uh, bevel and emboss and possibly drop shadow. So here we go. We'll go ahead and get this going. Um, the first thing you wanna do when you're dealing with textures is just open the texture that you're uh, dealing with. And this one, we're just gonna do a basic uh, silver glitter. I usually like to keep the navigator open. The navigator is kind of my jam. Um, but to get this as an actual texture, you go to Edit, Define Pattern, and then you'll you'll just name the pattern. We're going to name it just Silver Glitter, which is just fine. And uh, it doesn't it doesn't look like it does anything, but um, Photoshop actually saves it as a texture. So what we do is we go in here and just do uh, um, we'll do it just like this, and we'll go ahead and just make this large enough where you can see it. I kind of dig this font, it's kind of cool. But uh, to get this texture on here, you just go to Layer, Layer Style, and this is where you do all your layer modifications. You'll go to a Pattern Overlay, because textures are technically called patterns in Photoshop. And you'll see it, it'll, uh, our silver glitters down here. There's a couple different, you know, a couple different ones I've used, but this is the one we just set up. You can scale the, the glitter to something that looks like you think it should look. Like, I think that looks about right. And see, it moves with the texture, and that's how you do it. And it looks really good. Um, if you want to do take this one step further, you can go ahead and throw a drop shadow on there. Um, just do a little bit of an offset. You know, play with those. Get those right. Bring down the opacity a little bit. And then we'll do a bevel and emboss. Which we're, we're set to emboss. I think that looks okay. But yeah, and that, that's how you add textures and various effects. Guys, I appreciate y'all taking the time to check out this tutorial. If you have any other ideas for Photoshop tutorials, feel free to drop them in the comments below. Um, also, please subscribe and like the video for updates on future content. I appreciate it, guys. Thanks.